Amsen presents 16 tenses in English. Part 1. Let's dive in. The English language has 16 tenses. Today we're going to do only 12 of them and owe you the last four at a later date. The English language has 16 tenses, grammar tenses that is, with a slight difference between how the British and the Americans use one or more of the tenses. The present perfect tense is one example, but we'll get to that later. And we'll see which tense is used widely in the seventh grade English textbooks in Japan. And with that being said, let's roll. Let's start with our basic tense. Number one, the simple present tense. Example, I play basketball every week. I play basketball every week. This expresses or explains some routine that you do regularly. It's a routine. I play basketball every week, or you play basketball every week. We don't say, example, I read a book. We would say I read books daily, something that expresses a routine, something that's regularly. Two, present progressive. I'm playing basketball now. I'm playing basketball now. This expresses something that you are doing now. Something that you are doing now. We won't say I'm play I'm play basketball. That'd be wrong. I'm playing basketball now. I'm playing basketball now. Simple past. Example, I played basketball yesterday, or I played basketball an hour ago, or a minute ago. Something that you did in the past, a finished action. We don't say, I'm playing, ba I'm playing basketball yesterday. We would say, I played basketball yesterday. It's a finished action. Past progressive. Example, I was playing basketball the, the, the whole evening. I was playing basketball the whole evening. This express, expresses something that you were doing at a specific time. Now, usually this is used when you want to tell a story or add more detail about a past action. I was playing basketball the whole evening when something happened. We don't say, I was played basketball the whole evening. That'd be wrong. Five, present perfect. Get ready for this ride. Okay, this is the tense that is the most confusing due to the British and their monopoly on textbook publishing, pushing this one. Present perfect. Americans are much less likely to use the present perfect tense than the British, or we use it differently than how the British or the Australians use it. There is no reason to complicate matters. And the Japanese Ministry of Education just goes with whatever is the path of least resistant. Even if they have, even if they have to cut corners and have their teachers teach nonsensical stuff that no native English speaker uses in writing or in everyday conversation. And with that being said, here's some examples. Look, example, have you washed your hands? British. Have you washed your hands? Did you wash your hands? Americans, did you wash your hands? Simple. British. 
Have you got a favorite t-shirt? Have you got a favorite t-shirt? Americans, do you have a favorite t-shirt? Do you have a favorite t-shirt? I have played basketball. Why? It's a bit confusing. You can just say, I played basketball already. I played basketball already. As, as for Japan, Japan refuses to do things properly, which is why their population can't speak English or read anything past what they have been taught in nonsensical textbooks. Imagine learning a new language, skipping over the basics, phonics, idioms, blends, and not learning the culture of the language you're learning. Oh, and your classes are not only taught 90% in your native language, Japanese in this case, but encouraged by people who train incoming teachers who were also trained by others who don't know jack sh about the English language and are then encouraged to teach English by teaching whole classes in Japanese. Japan ought to be ashamed of itself. Now, back to the slides. Six, present perfect progressive. Example, I have been playing basketball for three hours now. It's important to put now. The present perfect progressive tense shows something that you have been doing up until now, up until this moment. In this case, you have been playing basketball for three hours now. Past perfect, number seven. Example, I had played basketball before Mary came. Also the British usage here. Um, Something that you did before something else happened. So two things happen with past perfect. Or you can just simply say, I had already finished playing basketball before Mary came. Simple. That would be the American. Americans would mostly, usually, most, mostly, most use this form instead of the last, uh, the last confusing form. I had already finished playing basketball before Mary came. So, two things happened here. Uh, you finished playing basketball and then Mary came. Future will. Example. Usually we put I think, because will, will is usually like prediction. You can use it for planning, for plans or something. But usually I think I will play basketball next week. Why do we say I think? Something that you will, that you will possibly do in the future, a prediction. I think I'll play basketball next week. Future going to. I'm going to play basketball this afternoon. This is something that you are going to do, 90% sure. It's already been decided. I'm going to play basketball this afternoon. Future going, or I'm playing basketball this afternoon. Most Americans will not say I will play basketball this afternoon. Most Americans will say I'm playing basketball this afternoon because it's something that you are going to do. You're 90% sure it's already been decided. I'm playing basketball this afternoon. Future progressive. Example, I will be playing basketball next Sunday. I will be playing basketball next Sunday. This is something that you will hopefully be doing granted that nothing happens before then. I will be playing basketball next Sunday. Future perfect. I will have played basketball by tomorrow. I will have played basketball by tomorrow. This is something that you will have already done before a set time or day. You will have, I will have played basketball by tomorrow evening. Let's go over that one more time. Let's review. Simple present. I play basketball every week. I play basketball every week. 
Present progressive. I am playing basketball now. I am playing basketball now. Simple past. I played basketball yesterday. I played basketball an hour ago. I played basketball two minutes ago. Four. Past progressive. I was playing basketball the whole evening. I was playing basketball the whole evening. Five. Present perfect. I have just played basketball. I have just played basketball. Or, I just played basketball. I just played basketball. American usage. Six. Present per perfect progressive. I have been playing basketball for three hours now. I have been playing basketball for three hours now. Seven. Past perfect. I had played basketball before Mary came. I had played basketball before Mary came. Or, I played basketball before Mary came. American usage. I played basketball before Mary came. Eight. Past perfect progressive. I had been playing basketball when Mary came. I had been playing basketball when Mary came. Nine. Future will. I will play basketball next week. I will play basketball next week. 10. Future going to. I'm going to play basketball this afternoon. I'm going to play basketball this afternoon. 11. Future progressive. I will be playing basketball next Sunday. I will be playing basketball next Sunday. 12. Future perfect. I will have played basketball by tomorrow. I will have played basketball by tomorrow. Smash that like and subscribe button.